In this particular gait analysis, we were attempting to find out if this runner's feet and hips behaves differently in different pairs of racing shoes. This particular patient worked through each of the phases that you just saw. Our primary goal with this particular gait analysis for him was to determine if his feet and hips were behaving differently given different pairs of racing shoes. Ultimately, the work that we had done as described in the earlier portions of this video didn't change his mechanics given a certain pair of shoes, but it did give him a certain amount of comfort, feeling of stability, and control regardless of which pair of shoes he was wearing, which he didn't report at an earlier gait analysis before starting this work. For this patient, going through each of these steps was crucial to give him the confidence in his body that he would perform the way he wanted to on race day.